Hello, my fellow eggheads. I'm Liz, I'm a certified technician. Today, we're gonna to go over what to do if you spill any sort of beverage on your laptop. Let's get to it. Hello, my fellow eggheads, this is Liz. All right, you've spilled something and you can just picture the droplets inside the components in your computer. It's dreaded liquid damage. Ah, so now it is time to clean off your components from any dried liquid or wet liquid. All right, I'm a certified technician. My name is Liz and I'm gonna show you how to do it. First, unplug your computer and then you wanna take the battery out because what fries components is not the fact that simply liquid is on it. It's the fact that liquid is on it or dried on it when there is power running through it. If you find this video in any way helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. So what I'm going to need is I am going to need um, some sort of cleaner, like a 70% acetyl alcohol with a microfiber cloth, a toothbrush, and some sort of, I'm going to use a compressed air cannon, but you could also use a hair blow dryer on low and cool, or you could use a can of compressed air. So I'm going to go inside my computer. You will need a disassembly video because each model of computer is different but I'm gonna go inside and I'm going to clean off the damage because like I said, even dried liquid can cause connections that are not supposed to be there. So when you turn your computer on, it fries. So we are in a crisis situation, my friends. All right, so what we're going to do is I'm going to use that microfiber cloth and I'm gonna clean off any sort of liquid I see, if it's wet or if it's dry, I'm gonna use a little bit of that isopropyl alcohol. Like I said, 70% solution is ideal. Um, you can get away with Windex, but you you really need to make sure it's dry when you're done and I'm going to wipe off any sort of liquid that's either dry or wet and I need that thing to be bone dry before power runs through it okay and I'm doing all of this while unplugged and not live like I said before and uh, also when it's done I'm going to take my air cannon and I am going to clean anything that could possibly be wet from my cleaner or from the spill because I don't want any sort of liquid and then when I'm done I'm going to do any part of my computer that could possibly be wet because the goal here is to have it be dried and if there's any liquid to clean it off if possible because like I said that's what fries your computer. Is there being uh, dried on liquid or just uh, wet liquid on components that are not supposed to be on there? So I'm going to be very, very, very thorough and do my best to make sure it's dry. Um, water is a little bit of an easier situation than perhaps like a soda or something like that, but any of it's really not great. So I'm gonna do a really good job. And when it's all done, I'm going to flip my computer upside down and let it dry because the isopropyl alcohol will dissipate, which is why it's really the ideal to use. But anyway, from one egghead to another egghead, this is Liz signing out. So from one egghead to another egghead, this is Liz signing out.